This is the Pocket Monster Manual. I'm Wooly Shambler here with MD. I like tadpoles. Rusty. I don't. And Shiny. He's not even a tadpole, he's got legs. And we're talking about Poliwhirl. It is worth noting that this is Mr. Tajiri's favorite Pokemon. Why has he got gloves on? Why has he got gloves on? Why has he got gloves on? To punch people with his hands. Riddle me that. Why the fuck so, has he got gloves so on? So check it. Did he you looks, guys... He looks like the jump man. He really does. Did you guys ever notice that before Piplup came around, before 2006 or seven, Poliwhirl was in a lot of promotional stuff. Like the big logo. Yeah. Like the Pokemon logo. Let me see if I can find it. He was in it. Like, he is absolutely Satoshi Tajiri's favorite Pokemon. And frankly, I can't blame him. I, it's kind of weird that it's not Poliwag or Poliwrath to me, but... I don't know. I think... Well, Poliwrath's too, Poliwrath's too angry, and Poliwag doesn't have any gloves on. Yes. So. Poliwhirl is so friendly looking. It's hard to explain, but I love its design. He doesn't have any eyebrows. Yeah, or a mouth. Before we get into the Pokedex entries, let's talk about Poliwhirl's mouth. Where is it? Let's see if it explains it. Perhaps he feeds through his ace. No. That's gross. <laughs> I mean, it says that he eats things in the Dexes, so... He just absorbs it through his skin. That's disgusting. You just gotta slather him with the, with the meat. And the swirl on its belly subtly undulates. Undulates. Yeah, I was about to read that. <laughs> Staring at grass like causes drowsiness. In the anime, it shows Poliwhirl blasting water gun from the center of its swirl. Oh my god. It had a colostomy? That's fucked up, man. Yeah. Fucked up if true. I don't like it. Did you know Poliwhirl sweats to keep its body slimy? Ew. I'll be honest, I love Poliwhirl anyway. Yeah. He's, he, is so, he learns Earthquake, did you know that? I do now. There might be a, I mean, a lot of people learn Earthquake, but a lot of Pokemon learn Earthquake, not people. But. Yeah, but like, it's still really funny to like think about the ones that can and look at him, and yeah. he does. He's quite literally a greasy boy. Yep. Yep. He's always wet and slick with an oily fluid. Even though Satoshi Tajirim loves him so much, he's never been like a big star in any of the spin-offs. I think it's just the the others talked him down. Like there are more marketable Pokemon than Poliwhirl. I don't know. I think Poliwhirl like hits a lot of notes as far as like what well, Pikachu does, just not as not as well. He's not like super feminine, but he's not like super masculine. He looks friendly, but he also has like fists. He could punch something if he needed to. And it looks distinctive with the swirl, so I guess you're right. Yeah, he's a very well-rounded design, no pun intended. Generation 7 has started giving like advice to how to keep your Pokemon healthy. You notice that? Yeah, I agree. Yeah. No, I have got to moisturize him. But why don't you just make him go for a run so he sweats? Ew, gross. So it would provide his own grease. Do you think anyone like uses Poliwell grease as a like facial moisturizer or body lotion? Makes sense. I mean, don't they use like snail like stuff for that? Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, I absolutely. Just, see it's it. probably some traditional medicine bullshit yeah. that has Poliwell slime. Yeah. I have my bathroom Poliwell that I rub <laughs> myself up upon when I'm. <laughs> oh no, we have a real Poliwell. <laughs> yeah, he just sits there. Waiting. That's horrible. <laughs> no, it's okay. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna keep rubbing it in my fucking face. <laughs> We're moving on. <laughs> Maybe that's why he's got to wear gloves. <gasps> so he takes his gloves off, and you get face massage. And it's all good. <laughs> no. <laughs> Ew, no.